Hubrick and Jason Learning collaborated with STEM Minds to create a case study. They developed the study to enable students to experiment and create to demonstrate the positive impact Hubrick can have in the educational world. I mean, this is about your perspective. We then gave the students two challenges. The first challenge is you're an entrepreneur, you have a business idea, you want to launch a product. You have the image of the product in your head. Use Kubrick to create a prototype version of it. The students quickly picked up Kubrick's interface and immediately understood how to develop their ideas. I feel like it's like, because you're prompting it, it's like different. It's kind of like dictating what you're saying. Uh, so if you're like specific enough, it's going to like display what you want. In less than an hour, the students developed products and ideas to showcase to their peers, allowing them to tackle the next challenge. The next challenge was creating a scene that they could use as a base for a story, presentation, or class project. They used Kubrick to create images and visualizations for their work. I think it's like a really good tool to use whenever I need help with school, because for a lot of like media projects, I'll need help like visualizing scenes or like making a storyboard or whatever. Then this is really helpful for like if I just need to do it quickly and I don't have a lot of time, especially with a bunch of other assignments going on. Like the interface is really, it's really simple. It's easy to get hang of. Making an overall scene was pretty easy. I've had a few assignments where I've had to make a poster and no images online or anything I can really find is really what I've been, what I've imagined. So I think this is really useful for like generating exactly what you want. I'm very interested in to see where this goes. I think the concept of having something generated to make a bigger idea is really, really cool. I think, you know, exposing young people to the power of Kubrick and what generative AI can do and bringing creativity to life. A lot of times great ideas just sit inside the mind and not being able to visualize it. So Kubrick really enables that and hopefully more and more students will see the value um, in using tools like that and bringing their creativity to the forefront. So I think it's a great tool. I think they really enjoyed the creative part of it because suddenly an, an idea they had, oh, that's exactly how we imagined it looked like. And those aha moments were really great to watch. So I think the, the tool has a great power um, in supporting entrepreneurship, ideation, prototyping, uh, projects in schools very easily.